Hey, Coach Jesse Minch, also known as a Snake here. Got another new sneaker review for you. This is the Zoom Hyper Quickness. And I found these shoes to be awesome. And I honestly, I think I got them for like 30 bucks at the Nike outlet store. So you could probably find these yet online and get them on clearance or whatever. And for the price you pay, these perform just as well as some shoes that I've got or pretty close to some shoes that I've got for about 200 bucks. So, I mean, 30 bucks, you can't go wrong. Personally, after I tore my Achilles, I've been rocking a lot more high tops for basketball, not so much low tops. Even though rocking low tops, I, I know has nothing to do with why I tore my Achilles. It just kind of happened because it was ready to happen, but it's kind of like a mental thing. So on that end of thing, I like them. They have great support. They're high. They come up all the way to the top with the laces and there's good support. It's overall a fuse material, a hyper fuse material. So kind of like a thin plasticky material. But the thing I really like about them is they have a lot of ventilation, as you can see here. A lot of this here is, uh, you know, got some of those little dots or whatever you want to call it. It's almost like a hyperfuse mesh. And it keeps your foot pretty dry, which I liked a lot. And on top of that, the tongue is like a mesh material, like an actual mesh. And that ventilates really well. So great on that end of things. I like that I could take my sneakers off after I get done with playing basketball and they're not just sweating profusely and the shoes smell disgusting. That was probably one of the main reasons, one of the main things I don't like about the Kobe 9s, the highs that I have. Other than that, I love those shoes, but these crush it in that category. They keep your feet really dry, which is awesome. The fit is great when you just put them on. It just, the the form of the shoe just maybe it's just the shape of my foot but I think just the way they they crafted the shoe in general is just fits snug right in here in the middle like you want it to gives you enough room in the toes fits well on the heel and just you know locks you down really well I like that they got this little extra kind of a uh, strap thing or whatever that comes into the shoe and locks you down kind of by the midfoot there full length zoom in the bottom and it's the kind of zoom I like where it rides really low to the ground. Good traction on them. Pretty much your typical herringbone traction, but grips the floor really well. Pretty close to the Kobe 9s, not quite as good. Again, Kobe 9 to me is probably the best traction I've ever had in a shoe. Pretty close to that. I would say the Jordan 29 is probably slightly better than these as well. Other than that, though, I, I've had quite a dip, few different shoes lately, and these are one of the tops that performing as far as traction goes for me. They fit well, they lock you down, nice high top. Really not a lot to say about them. I mean, the design to me is just okay, nothing special, but if you want a shoe that's gonna perform well and you can get on the cheap, I would definitely recommend you pick up a, a pair of these Hyper Quicknesses. Great shoe in so many aspects. Nothing, you know, overly special. You know, a lot of the technology, the Hyper Fuse, the Zoom, they've had for a while and whatnot, but they just perform well, they fit well. You know, nothing to complain about, nothing that's really over the top awesome, but everything I would say is great, like really great. So, you know, put all that together in a package and you can get it for 30 bucks. That's pretty sweet. Uh, these are 11s and I wear 10 and a half, sometimes an 11 and I got myself the 11 and these fit perfect for me. So, you know, if you're kind of on the line there, maybe go up to that next half size. You know, you might want to try them on as well, just to be sure. But that's my review of the Nike Zoom Hyper Quickness. One last look for you. And if you found this video helpful, make sure you give me a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button. I'll have a lot more review videos like this coming for you guys. Also bring back Coach Jason Shooty, a.k.a. Kicks, for a couple more of these videos as well. He's got some sneakers, of course. His name's Kicks for a reason. And, uh, you know, some of his basketballs as well, some Tachikara basketballs and whatnot. But... Uh, stay tuned. We'll have a lot more videos coming for you guys. Also, of course, you know, all the different uh, tutorials, tips, drills on basketball moves, shots, you know, all that kind of stuff coming for you guys. Um, so, yeah, make sure you hit the subscribe button so you can catch all of that. And if you haven't yet, head over to GetHandles.com. Make sure you get your free ball handling workout and guide. going to help you take your entire game to the next level, especially your ball handling ability. Grab that while you can for 100% free Yes, free. All you got to do is pop in your email and I'll send that over you right away. Instantly, you will get that. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more.